Hey you guys, what's up? Welcome back to Books Being Stuff. I'm doing a review on the second book in the Shirley series by Annabeth Albert. The book is called Sink or Swim. This book actually features um, author's older brother, Calder. If you have not read the first book, Sailor Proof, I will link that review in the description bar below so you guys can check that out as well too. Now, Calder is very much more, it's very different from author as you guys. If you read the first book, understands he's much different than Arthur. He has more of a competitive spirit, if you could say. He has more. He's more competitive, and you know, he's him and Derek are best friends from the um from the ship. Um, they're in the navy. They're in the navy together. Um, meanwhile, Calder is on his way to to a cabin just to relax, you know, get his mind right and things like that. And when he gets to the cabin, he goes in, takes a nap. A few minutes later, a guy and two young little girls come there and the little one of the little girls is shocked that somebody's in there. Come to find out the guy name is Felix and he is a doctor and that cabin was his cabin because it was from his grandparents and Come to find out his ex-husband, because I think they were in the, they're in the process of a divorce. His ex-husband actually betted on that cabin and called her won that in a poker game. Let me pause right here for a minute. How much of a jerk you have to be to bet your ex-husband's cabin in a poker game? How much of a jerk? How? Especially if you know this cabin is so is important to him. Child. Meanwhile, Calder had hit his head, and you know he had to take time off all stuff for that too. As long, along with um getting his mind right and stuff, Felix, being a doctor, wants to make sure his head is okay. He's not a concussion or anything, and they rest. Um, meanwhile, over the weekend, you know Calder and Felix get to know each other, and Felix gets to know um Calder, um Felix's nieces as well too. Um, so that's that. Um, the youngest girl, Charlotte, takes an instant liking to Felix. I think Madeline likes him, but she's a little more reserved. And Charlotte, the younger daughter, is more, um, is much more, um, of an extrovert and things like that. I like the two little girls in the book. They're, they're really cute. Um, meanwhile, of course, you have some cameos from, um, Derek and Arthur and, of course, um, Calder's mama. I like Calder's mama, by the way, too. She just seems, um, I think her name is Jane, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I'll, I'll put it the right name in the video if I'm wrong. But she is real cool. She's like, she basically, you know, raised, raised all the kids. And, you know, she just was like, she was a, a Navy wife, you know. And she's wondering when are you going to find the right relationship, blah, blah, blah. And, of course, Felix's stepmother is the same way. Like, you know, this guy is real cool, Calder is real cool. And as they get to know each other, they get to know each other outside and inside the bedroom. Now the inside the bedroom, child. Um <laughs> let's just say hot, hot, hot. Um you know you focus more on the more Calder's background and things like that. And there are a lot of um, things you may have thought because I'm gonna be real with you. In the first book, I thought Calder was really a jackass. Really, I really couldn't. I'm not gonna say I hated him, but I really wasn't fond of him in the beginning, especially the way he treated Arthur. But this book actually got me liking him a bit more. Like it really warmed me up to him a bit more, and I'm like, oh, okay. Um, he's very organized, which I do like. Um. I recommend, I like this book because it does talk about um, starting over, especially um, starting over with two children, especially after a divorce. Um, it talks about just getting to know people instead of that outside appearance, you really get to know them as a person as well too, as Felix does calendar as well too. And it definitely teaches you to be in the ready-made family. and. Of course, you have a lot of submarine um, terms and things, like Navy terms that I even learned about as well, too, in this book. So it's really cool that Annabeth actually has story with a bit of, it was some heat, um, sort of low, it's kind of low angst, and it is low angst, 
and some educational um, tips on top of that too. So I definitely enjoyed that as well too. Um, you have, and I like that group of friends too. The family, you the family is off the hook. They have a lot of people there too. Um, yeah, so I will be linking that book below as well too. As a matter of fact, I'm going to link Annabeth's um, website below so you can check out her other books as well too. Um, yeah, because I did a review on some other books of hers too. So, also in the video, you can check, um, click on the hashtag Annabeth Albert to see what else I reviewed as well too. Um, I hope you guys have a good weekend. This video is not going up until next month. Today is the 12th of May. So, this is part of my, um, one of my prime books I definitely recommend. So, yeah, definitely check that out. I will talk to you later, and um, thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoy reading. Bye now.